Yeah. Right, so we got uh, yeah. Joe Cueto, right? Yep. You got Brother Ralph. Oh, thank you, bro. The first time I got somebody out of the wheelchair, this guy was there. Oh, yeah? Yeah. That's awesome, yeah. man. What was your name, bro? Savio. 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 Yeah. Savio. He's right, got a check in India. Oh, okay. That's awesome, man. Well, I got you guys. You just got in. Yeah. You ready to see some things? Cool. All right, man. Yeah. Let's go eat. Let's change chances. <laughs> All right, we got uh, Quayla over here eating. Great. We did the burgers like this in California. Oh, and who's this? Jaren. I'm just, uh, you know, Jesus in a Jaren suit. <clears throat> Uh oh, all right, man. Uh oh, who's this? Savio. Savio. What's up, man? Where you from? California. California. What's your origin? Um, from India. You're from India. Yeah. And you're from Brazil. Mm -hmm. And you're from Hutch. Heaven. No, I'm from Heaven. Oh, okay. I'm from Heaven. You're from Heaven. Also, we come here and feed Brig Awesome and Burger Place. Then uh, I'm going to stay one week. But. The food we eat today, it's for one week already, it's so big, the, <laughs> the food, That's it. it's no refill. So anyways, like I always do, I put on the little hat, pull the camera out like this. Okay, uh, guys, I got it. Jared's trying to get the camera from me. Let me go this way, let's go this way, yeah, okay. <laughs> I don't mind though. Hey, but anyways, uh, my name is Pete Cabrera Jr. and um, we just picked up uh, Jose Cuelo. He's gonna be staying with us for a week and uh, see if we can learn from each other, man. The worst is that iron sharp is iron and uh, that we are to uh, fellowship and to walk with like-minded believers. So he's out here and we're gonna learn from each other. And uh, so I'm just glad he's here and we're just gonna do what we do in Christ Jesus. So stay tuned. Say you have some pain in your hands, something yes, like yes. that. Yes, yes. See, I'll provide us in these fingers. Yeah. Sometimes mm -hmm. I can't even bend them down. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, when we are in the, in the kitchen right now, and then this lady come and and uh, Pete introduces to her, and she, she says something, have some pain, like arthritis and pain in the back, something like this. So, um, can I have your hands? Mm -hmm. um, this is about kingdom of heaven, it's about Jesus. As I say, by his stripes we are healed. Yes. Okay? So is anything in the earth is not, is not from the kingdom of heaven, like pain or tries, it's not kingdom of heaven. Okay? Okay. You need to go now. Say so what? You need to go now. Okay? It needs to go now. Okay. Yeah, it needs oh. to go. Okay. Okay? okay. This arthritis is not yours. Okay? Right. So right now, I'm going to speak to the problem and say, arthritis, you go. You leave this woman right now in Jesus' name. All pain, go. No. 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 Do you feel anything in your hands, Sister Ann? Just this finger right here. Mm -hmm. Just that one. Yeah, and the rest is good? Yes. Yeah? Yes. Yeah. Even the shoulder. Yeah. Okay. In the back. Ain't that cool? The back is good? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> yes. It's just amazing, huh? Yes, it is. Yeah? So, Anne, I bless you now, and I release a life in you right now. Life in the name of Jesus. Life. 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 Thank you, Lord. Thank you for your kingdom. <clears throat> for anybody who's watching, the reason that I record things is because uh, we're brothers that are like-minded. We need to walk together. How you feeling? And and this is Sister Anne. Take the glass off. Right. You feeling that, ain't you, Anne? Feels really good. <laughs> now, Sister Anne, her husband is a pastor. Hmm. 
You feeling that all through your body? You feel that, sister? There you go. Thank you. <laughs> okay. Also, uh, when he say um, something for you, uh, I want to give a word for you. When I, I listened to the conversation before between you and him there uh, about in your house, something in your house. You have authority because you are a daughter of the mighty God. All right. And I, I like to teach this for you because the things you speak have a power. The power of life and the death is in our tongue. When you feel the tingle in your mouth, I really feel in my spirit God saying to you, use your mouth to take authority in your house and command that to go. Oh, all right. Yeah, okay. that's awesome. Okay? All right. Because uh, I, I, I want to speak for you right now in your life. Okay? I want to speak that. And this is a teaching. Okay? I declare in your life prosperity. I, de I declare in your house everything has been stolen for you from the enemy. He pay back seven times more. It's scriptural. Okay? okay, that's yours. He's a thief, but Jesus come, John 10, 10, Jesus come, forgive abundant life. Yes. Okay, mm -hmm. I declare life in you, life in your house, prosperity in your, in your house, in your host house, in your family, in the name of Jesus. Thank you. Because you are a princess. Thank you. You are a princess, the mighty God. You are a kingdom representation in the earth because you're daughter of the king, daughter of the king. Just remember that, who you are. You have authority. Okay. All right. Can All right. Yes. <laughs> I'm the hug guy. Okay. Right. He's the hug guy. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Jesus. <clears throat> um, but anyways, okay. we like to do a lot of teachings, and um, we just need to step out of our comfort zone, just do things that God has called us to do. So. Um, We'll go from there.